we back with the Love Triangle game. Let's see what this planet has in store. What are these things? Are these enemy? Don't matter. It's dead. I guess they're not enemy, but you know, you, may, you can never trust anything in these days. A lot of enemies on the. Oh, sorry. A lot of enemies on the map. It's fine though. I'll teach him a lesson. You must find a way to disable their artillery. Don't worry. We'll figure it out. You know what? Just in case. You really thought. See? Work the smart way. We must find a way to yes, disable Yes, I heard artillery. you the first time. Thank you very much. Such a great tip. What's in here? So, the plan. Beat this game. I will not be playing the second one next. So that's something. But I'll have a game in between. Hello. Hello. The AA gun power controls. Disable. I'm reading that the grid is down, Commander. On approach to the Solarian base now. Out. Ready to move, Commander. Decryption's used up. Does it like tell me what to do? Like I don't understand that. I, I just don't get it. What do you do to get your decryption up? Can I just drop it? Of course you can't. Of course you can't drop. Ridiculous. So dumb. Your stamina is like two feet and then you're out. Get in the stupid vehicle. Alright, so we're looking forward, so W. What the heck? Lucky I recognize that ship. Okay. It's about a pop of one. I honestly don't even know how that hit him, considering he was behind something, but sure. I don't know where they are. Everyone out of the vehicle. We're moving on. You think you're cool because you have a shield? Shield can't help you when you get punched in the face. Wow, that took all my shields away. Okay. Anything else in here? That did it. We shouldn't have any more trouble reaching the camp. Good. Because I'm sick of this stupid driving. The driving in this game is no bueno. Wow, nice of you to join us. Ready. Yeah, you're ready after we're already done with that place. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Keep it moving. Okay. That's not sprint. Whomst else wants to die? I'll kill you all. Normandy's touched down at the base, but it looks like we're grounded. The Solarian captain can explain when you get here. Uh, of course. There's always issues. Issues with literally everything, all the time. There we go. Oh, any issues? I'll There's shoot you. Camp. I was tempted to shoot him to see what would happen, but. So what are we supposed to do now? Yeah. Stay put until we can come up with a plan. What's going on? Are you in charge here? What's the situation? I'm Captain Kirahi, 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG. So. You and your crew have just landed in the middle of a hot zone. Every AA gun within 10 miles has been alerted to your presence. Did I not just take them That's down? That's just great. What now? We stay put until the Council sends the reinforcements we requested. We are the reinforcements. We are the reinforcements. <laughs> hey. What? You're all they sent? I told the Council to send a fleet. Uh, the message was unclear. We couldn't understand your transmission. They sent me to investigate. 
That is a repetition of our task. I lost half my men investigating this place. So what have you found? Saren's base of operations. He set up a research facility here. It's crawling with Geth and very well fortified. Bro, I'll What's take Saren researching? He's using the facility to breed an army of Krogan. How is that possible? Apparently, Saren has discovered a cure for the Genophage. The Geth are bad enough, but a Krogan army? He'd be almost unstoppable. Exactly my thoughts. We must ensure that this facility and its secrets are destroyed. <laughs> destroyed? I don't think so. Our people are dying. This cure can save them. If that cure leaves this planet, the Krogan will become unstoppable. We can't make the same mistake again. We are not a mistake. Is he going to be a problem? We already have enough angry Krogan to deal with. Mm, yeah, but like, on one hand, I don't really know, like, were they a problem beforehand? I'm assuming they were. But like, it's kind of rude to just, you know, let them die. He'll be fine. I'll talk to him. I'd appreciate that, Commander. My men and I need to rethink our plan of attack. Can you give us some time? Sure. Go ahead, Captain. I'll come back soon. We won't be long, Commander. In the meantime, if you need any supplies, you can talk to Commander Rentola. He's in one of the tents nearby. Hmm. Looks like things are a bit of a mess. Looks that way. Yeah. I wouldn't be so worried if it wasn't for Rex. He looks like he's gonna blow a gasket. <laughs> Question, like, I don't know who he is. You think I should go talk no. to him? Okay. It wouldn't hurt. Well, it might, actually. Just do it carefully. I'll be careful, but be ready, just in case. I'm always ready. She's always ready. Are you ready now? It won't be an easy fight. How about you? Are you ready? I don't like the way Rex is behaving. How am I supposed to know where he is? I don't know where he is. What the heck? Oh, that's assignments. Okay. We always get a little confused there. On edge. I found him. What's up, my boy? This isn't right, Shepard. If there's a cure for the Genophage, we can't destroy it. I understand. Calm down, Rex. I'm not the enemy here. Saren's the one you should be mad at. Really? Saren created a cure for my people. You want to destroy it. Technically, I didn't Help say that. Help me out here, Shepard. The lines between friend and foe are getting a little blurry from where I stand. Uh, I guess it's not this simple. This isn't a cure, it's a weapon! And if Saren is allowed to use it, you won't be around to reap the benefits. None of us will. That's a chance we should be willing to take. This is the fate of my entire people we're talking about. If you can't give me a better reason than this to destroy the hopes of my people, then I'm done with you. Whoa, whoa, chill, bro, chill. What do you want? I can't let you jeopardize the mission. That's just not what. So that's it. All not at all what I clicked. Like I what? From you. How can you not see what this means? I do see, Krogan? but this I can't. This can't be destroyed. I won't allow it. All right, we can work this out, bro. Rex. Please, we can discuss this. Yeah, chill, everybody, no chill. Whoa, talk, whoa, whoa. Shepherd. I've got to do this my way. Well, we can help you, bro. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well. I don't think so, friend. Well, I mean, I don't like that idea, but you know, it makes things easier. So good Thanks, work, Chief. He just wasn't gonna listen to reason. I kind of figured. Wait, what? Did you just kill him, Chief? Better him than the commander. Yeah, I suppose. Well, I'd rather have Rex on our side. He chose his path. Yeah, okay. Well, that's just not at all what I wanted to have happen. Things just didn't go our way. Rex's fate was regrettable. Why do people sound muffled? We better succeed, human. We still feel the toll of the crow. Don't call me a human. I'm not a human. I'm a commander, a specter, and I demand respect. I'm sorry the Krogan couldn't be reasoned with. So am I. Shall I arrange for a council-sponsored service, or should we dump his body in the swamps? <laughs> wow. We couldn't have gotten this far without him. Okay, we totally we could have, decent we him. You have a strange code of honor, Commander Shepard. But I will see the arrangements are made, assuming we survive the assault on Saren's base. I assume that means you've come up with a plan. Sounds like of it. We can convert our ship's drive system into a 20 kiloton ordnance. Crude, but effective. Nice. Drop that nuke from orbit, and Saren can kiss his Turian ass goodbye. 
Unfortunately, the facility is too well fortified for that. We'll need to place the bomb at a precise location. Okay. Where do we take the nuke? And how do we get there? The bomb must be taken to the far side of the facility. Your ship can drop it off, but we'll need to infiltrate the base, disable the AA guns, and pacify any ground forces first. You want us to go in on foot? We don't have enough men. I like it. Good. I prefer a straight fight anyway. It won't be that simple. Nah, it'll be easy. We just don't have the numbers to meet them head on. We don't need numbers. I'm I can take them all on. Into three teams and hit the front of the facility. One v whatever While you got. While we've got their attention, you can sneak your shadow team in the back. All right, works for me. I just hope you survive long enough to be useful. We're tougher than we look, Commander. But it's true. Mm. I don't expect many of us will make it out alive, and that makes what I'm going to ask even more difficult. I need one of your men to accompany me, to help coordinate the teams. That is a bold request. You expect me to commit one of my people to your command? We are all soldiers by trade. If your people are not prepared to face such a risk, would you really want them by your side? He's right, Commander. We can't do this without both teams at their best. I volunteer. All right. Not so fast, LT. Commander Shepard will need you to arm the nuke. Well, between the two of them, we already know who we're choosing. With all due respect, Gunnery Chief, it's not your place to decide. Why is it that whenever someone says, with all due respect, they really mean kiss my ass? Take him. Elenko, you're with the captain. Keep it simple, understood? Aye, aye, Commander. I will have the ordinance loaded onto the Normandy and brief your crew on its detonation sequencing. Do you have any questions before we go, Commander? Nah, eh, I'm fine. I'm ready when you are, Captain. Excellent. Then if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare my men. Well, this is it. Don't do anything foolish while I'm gone, Ash. And that goes for you too, Commander. We'll be fine, LT. Yeah, I just... Good luck. What's your problem? Is there something you wanted to say, Caden? It's just weird, going under someone else's command. I've got so used to working with you. All of you. Don't worry so much. We'll see you on the other side. Will we? I know, I, um... I just wanted to say that it's been an honor serving with you, Commander. We're a it team. doesn't matter if we're not in the More same than team. a team, we're, we're still a family. A team. Watch each Vin other's Diesel backs, style. keep your eyes open, and fight like I know you can. We'll all come out of this in one piece. Mm -hmm. You bet, Commander. You betcha. Like Chet. You all know the mission, and what is at stake? I don't know the mission, could you repeat it? I have come to trust each of you with my life. That's cute. But I have also heard murmurs of discontent. I share your concerns. We are trained for espionage. We would be legends, but the records are sealed. Glorying in battle is not our way. Think of our heroes. A silent step who defeated a nation with a single shot. Or the ever alert who kept armies at bay with hidden facts. These giants do not seem to give us solace here, but they are not all that we are. Before the network, there was the fleet. Before diplomacy, there were soldiers. Our influence stopped the Rachni, but before that, I mean, they're back, held so. the line. Our influence stopped the Krogan, but before that, we held the line. Our influence will stop Saren. In the battle today, we will hold the line. Woo. Good luck, Commander. I hope we will meet again. Actually, I kind of hope we don't. Like, I don't know who you is. Oh, he's gone. Oh, he's gone too. How sad. Except. A footprint. All that was left is not even footprints, Zachary. Com check. Do you read me, Commander? Affirmative. Loud and clear. Good. We'll start our push. We'll try to make it to the AA guns, but it might be up to you to finish the job. And Commander, if you see any way to undermine their defenses, we could definitely use the help. So just kill everyone I see. Shadow is on the ground. Repeat, Shadow that was on quick. How did they even see me enough to do that? Is that a dude up there? No. That is a dude up there, I was right. Crouch down. Excuse me? How are you not dead?
Metagel used. Oh, hello. Hello. Jerk. Decryption too low. Disrupt. Now what? We just keep going straight. Do I go down here? I don't know where I'm going. This looks like a way. Something scrambled. They're targeting. We've got a shot. Lieutenant Alenko, take the heat off man alive. How's it going? Okay, I was literally greeting you, and you start shooting me. So toxic, bro. Can't even say hi to your enemies anymore? What the heck? Right, go. That thing took a lot more hits than I was expecting it to. They're calling sat strikes. JLO, watch for comm stations. Alenko, can you see anything? I don't think he saw anything. He didn't respond. I don't know if crouching actually helps, but in most games it does, so I'm gonna do it. Oh, what are you, crazy? That man, crazy. Just full on. Guns a blazing, charging at me like that. Toxic. Aircraft heading to perimeter stations to recharge. Bunker up before they come back. Which way are we going? A refueling platform. This probably will help them more, so we'll go this way. Gotta figure if you take out the refueling. But where exactly is it? This way. Yeah, you guys deal with them. That's a lot of dudes. None of that's working. I don't know what all my abilities do. Just to be honest. Let's do. Am I just shoot it? Slow war balance, not get stuck. Still an exclamation. I don't see any more. I don't know. Is there anything below us? No. Exclamation's gone. Run, run, run as fast as you can. You can't run fast because you're always out of stamina. Where's this guy? It fires. Air threat is not Something. materialized. We may be getting some help. Come on, Krogan. Get off the cover. Why are they running you like that? Any other naming things? Facility entrance, facility entrance. I don't see a difference, so we're going this way. Must be getting close. Hold the line, men. Hold the line. Yeah, we're getting close, all right.
Tell me I'm gonna come here and they're gonna say we can't go in. Access base security. We've got access to base security. Should be able to cut the alarms from here. Might even be able to trigger alarms on the far side of the base. It'll clear the guards out for us, but they might be too much for Lieutenant Alenko and the Solarians to handle. Hmm. They can't handle Just it. Just disable the alarms. We can handle any guards inside. Yeah, we can. Open up. Spectres. Okay, that's a lot of dudes. Shooting grenades at me. Ow. Now these are Solarians. Solarians? I don't know. If I... They're not like mind controlled, right? That's not like a thing in this. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Like I'm wondering if I should switch to the other grenade. A juggernaut. Ow. That was painful. Give me some more health, bro. More aid, we're good. Do doom. Decryption is too low. <laughs> what a shocker. Hello? Is someone out there? Yeah, it's me. What's up? I'd save you, but you know I can't free jump, so. I really feel like I should probably ground, try to, we don't want them to bunker up. grenade them, them but too bad. We've already killed enough of them. Turn. Decryption too low. No. Oh. What do you want? I told you everything. I. Who are you? Alliance, right? I knew someone would come. It tried to break me, but it couldn't. I shut it out. Uh, you're right. Slow down. I need to know where you came from. Private Maino Savata of the 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG, sir. Captured well on reconnaissance six days ago. Glad to answer, sir. Never any questions from these bastards. Just whispers and poking and cutting. I'd have said anything to get out and get some payback. That's not too much to ask, is it? A little payback? Can you help me, or will I be carrying you out of here? I'll be at your back every step of the way. I just need to get out of here and away from that incessant whispering. They piped it in for days now. Something's not right here. Yeah, I don't... I don't like it, but we can't just leave him. If we don't let him out, he's as good as dead. We have to do something. Yes, leaving me here would be bad. Very bad. It's too small and the noise just won't go away. Whispering is loud, you know? I need to get out. Let me out. More than likely, we'll let him out and he'll just turn on us so we can just get him free. He could help us. Yes, sir. You'll find I am Obviously very good at following orders. Brainwashed. I hear them over and over. Why are they repeated when they are so simple? <laughs> simple! Yep. Why, why would we release all of them? How does that make any sense? I say release one dude and you release all of them. Congratulations, you're stupid. Like, I figured, like, the, obviously the whispering's not in the cell. But, you know, you never know. Maybe he was beating it and could be of use. This is red. Some crates. Why give me so many things? That's suspicious. Okay. What are you shooting? It just leads the same way, right? Yeah, what the heck? Don't tell me I gotta go all the way back. Okay. Well, we can't go this way.
Darn. What am I supposed to do? Is there any other ways at any other point? I feel like it's been pretty... What's it? Linear. Elevator. Apparently not. What the heck? Oh, they're like growing. What How are you going on? Where are the gods? Who's behind me? Where is Sarah? Was she shooting me? That was weird. Don't really know what was going on. Keep moving, people. Our friends are dying. Who are you? Don't shoot! Please, I just want to get out of here before it's too late. Who are you? Let's hear it. Who are you, and what do you want? Ranathanoptis, neurospecialist. But this job isn't worth dying over, or worse. You think the indoctrination only affects prisoners? Sooner or later, Saren will want to dissect my brain, too. Yeah, why should Give me I trust one reason you? I, should help you. I... I can help you. This elevator behind me goes to Saren's private lab. I can get you in. Alright. See? Full access. All of Saren's private files. Are we good? Can I go? Hmm. Yeah, sure. I'm gonna blow this place to hell and gone. If you want to make it out alive, you better start running. What? You can't. But I'll never. Ah! Yeah, you better run. I enjoyed that. Okay. I didn't ask. Open up. Open up again. Hey, Saren. I wish to kill you. Come out so we may kill you. Where's that from? I don't remember. That's from some game. What's this? A communication? Commander, look panel. over here. It's another beacon, like the one on Eden Prime. Let's touch it. Touch it, touch it, touch, 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 touch. Yes. Yes. It all makes sense now. Say it. Say those words. Say them. Do it. Alright. He does not. He's still confused. What was the point in that? No. Oh. I get the feeling something bad is about to happen. You are not Saren. The heck is that? What is that? Some kind of VI interface? Rudimentary creatures of blood and flesh. You touch my mind, fumbling in ignorance, incapable of understanding. Cool voice. I don't think this is a VI. There is a realm of existence so far beyond your own, you cannot even imagine it. I am beyond your comprehension. I am Sovereign. That's the ship. Sovereign isn't just some Reaper ship Saren found. It's an actual Reaper. Reaper, a label created by the Protheans to give voice to their destruction. In the end, what they chose to call us is irrelevant. We simply are. The Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. You could not have been there. It's impossible. Organic life is nothing but a genetic mutation. An accident. Your lives are measured in years and decades. You wither. 
and die. We are eternal, the pinnacle of evolution and existence. Before us, you are nothing. Your extinction is inevitable. We are the end of everything. Pretty crazy to think that that could actually be real. Uh, I don't stand alone. There is an entire galaxy of like, races there could be united things that are just like out there, you. though. Just living. Confidence born of ignorance. The cycle cannot be broken. Oh yeah, watch this. Cycle? What, what cycle? The cycle. The game. The pattern has repeated itself more times than you can fathom. Organic civilizations rise, evolve, advance, and at the apex of their glory, they are extinguished. The Protheans were not the first. They did not create the Citadel. They did not forge the mass relays. They merely found them. The legacy of my kind. Uh, so he built them? Why would you construct the mass relays, then leave them for someone else to find? Your civilization is based on the technology of the mass relays. Our technology. By using it, your society develops along the paths we desire. We impose order on the chaos of organic evolution. You exist because we allow it, and you will end because we demand it. That's kind of rude. They are harvesting us, letting us advance to the level they need, then wiping us out. Yeah, who, where'd you come from? Where did you come from? Where'd you go? Where'd you who come from, Cotton Joe? We have no beginning. We have no end. We are infinite. Millions of years after your civilization has been eradicated and forgotten, we will endure. Where, the rest of Where you? are the rest of the Reapers? Are you the last of your kind? We are Legion. The time of our return is coming. Our numbers will darken the sky of every world. You cannot escape your doom. I don't care why they're doing it. We're going to kill them. You're not even alive. Not really. You're just a machine. And machines can be broken. Your words are as empty as your future. I am the vanguard of your destruction. This exchange is over. Well, that was rude. Commander, we got trouble. What? Hit me, Joker. That ship Sovereign, it's moving. I don't know what you did down there, but that thing just pulled a turn that would shear any of our ships in half. It's coming your way and it's coming hard. You need to wrap things up in there fast. This thing is fried. Orders, Commander? What's at the nuke? We'll head for the breeding facility. Time to blow this place to hell. Right, Commander. I'll meet you there. Joke around. I don't know where that is. I bet you that's where we went before. That'd make more sense. So we went right. Let's just run out the dude who's shooting us. That's a grand old idea. Yeah, returning from your position, Jayanto. Looks like Shadow kicked a sensitive spot. Alenko, head them off. Hold them. Hold them, bro. Hold them. Stupid gap. Not gap. Hold them. Pretty unfair they can just regen like that. So quickly too. This doesn't look familiar. So I don't really know where I'm going. That's a big gun. I saw the gun, I thought it was one of them. 
player. dead my boys gotta stay alive bro we were boys even though we don't use them you know what I'm saying everybody aid station we're maxed That's door it. control we need to clear the gate and open. set those charges Charge set. Everyone bunker down. Bunker down. Hello. Where are we going? <laughs> All right. Nice work. That's one less thing to worry about. Commander, I'm bringing us in. I'll get as close to the site as I can. All right. This is not where you're landing. Oh, there we go. My boys. Let's go. Another happy landing. Is that the nuke? That's gonna happen. Bomb is in position. We're all set here. Commander, do you read me? Yes. The nuke is almost ready, Lieutenant. Get to the rendezvous point. Negative, Commander. The Geth have us pinned down on the AA tower. We've taken heavy casualties. We'll never make the rendezvous point in time. Mm. Get them out of there, Joker. Now. Negative. It's too hot. You can't risk it. We'll hold them off as long as we... It's okay, Commander. I need a couple of minutes to finish arming the nuke. Go get them and meet me back here. Up to the AA tower. Move. Well, now who are we going to use? I guess you. We don't want to examine. Goodbye. How do we get to the AA tower? Is it over here? Guns up. I am fair, bro. They're just gonna keep healing. Come here. Jerks. Got a lot of them. Hold on. That's kind of cool. I never realized that when you switch guns on the bottom, it like has a little animation of it like setting up. So how's it been? How you been? On another mission. Been a while. What's in here? Take. It appears the Geth have sent reinforcements. It appears they're gonna all die. It's already here, and it's bleeding Geth all over the bomb site. How bad is it? Can you hold them off? There's too many! I don't think we can hold them! I'm activating the nuke! Whoa, 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 hold on. What are you doing, Chief? Making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what. We should go it's back. It's done, Commander. Go get the lieutenant and get the hell out of here. No, -uh, we're going back. Play that. 
We can handle ourselves. Go back and get Williams. Yeah, bro. Williams, radio Joker and tell him to meet us at the bomb site. Yes, Commander. I. It's the right choice, and you know it, Ash. Of course it was. Fight hard, Lieutenant. Die proud. Aye, aye, Commander. <laughs> Imagine being told just to die. Like, uh, that's pretty messed up. Like, yeah, we are not gonna save you, so just die and make sure you die good. Like, at least make it worth it. If you don't die good, that's honestly kind of trash. So make sure you die good. Run, run, run as fast as you can. We gotta save this lady. What do we do if we don't have the triangle, bro? We wouldn't be the triangle anymore. Not a triangle. Put that guy. so loud I applaud you Shepard my geth were utterly convinced the Salarians were the real threat an impressive diversion of course it was all for nothing I can't let you disrupt what I've accomplished here you can't possibly understand what's really at stake you work for a reaper sovereign and its kind destroyed the Protheans what else is there to understand you've seen the vision from the beacons Shepard you of all people should understand what the Reapers are capable of. They cannot be stopped. Do not mire yourself in pointless revolt. Do not sacrifice everything for the sake of petty freedoms. The Protheans tried to fight, and they were utterly destroyed. Trillions dead, but what if they had bowed before the invaders? Would the Protheans still exist? A submission not preferable to extinction? Yeah. I'd rather die than live under the rule of those machines. Now you see why I never came forward with this to the Council. We organics are driven by emotion instead of logic. We will fight even when we know we cannot win. But if we work with the Reapers, if we make ourselves useful, think how many lives could be spared. Once I understood this, I joined Sovereign, though I was aware of the dangers. I had hoped this facility could protect me. But it's not working. You're afraid Sovereign is influencing you. You're afraid he's controlling your thoughts. I've studied the effects of indoctrination. The more control Sovereign exerts, the less capable the subject becomes. That is my saving grace. Sovereign needs me to find the conduit. My mind is still my own. For now, but the transformation from ally to servant can be subtle. I will not let it happen to me. Hmm, seems like it's already happened, brother. Sovereign's manipulating you and you don't even know it. You're already under its power. No, Sovereign needs me. If I find the conduit, I've been promised a reprieve from the inevitable. This is my only hope. Join us, bro. Together, we can stop Sovereign. We don't have to submit to the Reapers. We can beat them. I no longer believe that, Shepard. Visions cannot be denied. The Reapers are too powerful. The only hope of survival is to join with them. Sovereign is a machine. It thinks like a machine. If I can prove my value, I become a resource worth maintaining. There is no other logical conclusion. 
You betrayed us. You were a specter. You were sworn to defend the galaxy. Then you broke that vow to save yourself. I'm not doing this for myself. Don't you see? Sovereign will succeed. Not it's inevitable. My way is the only way any of us will survive. I'm forging an alliance between us and the Reapers, between organics and machines. Or is this nuke set off yet? Like, what are we doing here? I will save more lives than have ever existed. But you would undo my work. You would do our entire civilization to complete annihilation. And for that, you must die. Not if I kill you first. Oh, okay. Oh, what are those shields? Why can't I use this? Oh, none of that worked. This guy ran closer, she's dead. Did I just die? What just happened? What just happened? We didn't kill him. It looked like we got hit with a rocket, and then this happened. I'm so confused. Alright everybody, hang on! What just happened? Literally, what was that? Okay. We're shooting the man, he shoots I us. I can't believe Caden didn't make it. How could we just leave him down there? He was a good soldier. Alenko knew the risks going in. He gave his life to save the rest of us. It should have been me, Commander. You know that. Wow, tear to my eye. I'm sorry, Ash. I'd never leave you behind. I couldn't. You that know that. not exactly what she said. I know, and I'm grateful. But Caden died because of me. Because of us. Mm. Yeah. Ash, how far are you going to drive yourself? Are you trying to be a martyr? To redeem your grandfather's honor? That's not fair. Wow, another tear to my eye. What the public and the military did to him was unfair. But I don't want to lose you because of it. Aye, aye, Shepard. And I think it Commander, was fair to say. Excuse me for interrupting, but I have an idea. I think the beacon you found in Saren's base was similar to the one you found on Eden Prime. Well, yeah, they're both beacons. It may have filled in the missing pieces of your vision. I might be able to help you put all those pieces together. Do it. You want to join our minds again, don't you? Okay, go ahead. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity. Nothing changed. Incredible. I I never thought the images would be so intense. I need a moment to collect myself. What did you see? Did the vision make any sense to you? Looked the same to me. It's a distress call. A message sent out across the Prothean Empire. A warning against the Reapers, but the warning came too late. Anything else? What about the conduit? There were other images, locations, places I recognized from my research. Ilos! The conduit is on Ilos! That is why Saren needed to find the Mu Relay. It is the only way to get to Ilos. Well, we gotta go. We need to get to Ilos. 
Forget it. The Mew relays inside the Terminus systems. Alliance ships are not welcome there. Neither are Spectres. Uh, well, we have no the choice. The on Ilos, and that's where Saren is heading. I'll be waiting for him when he gets there. Mm-hmm. Saren will have his entire fleet orbiting Ilos. You will never make it down to the surface without reinforcements. You must alert the Council. We need a fleet to... Uh... <laughs> Excuse sorry. me? The joining is exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down for a moment. You good? Dr. Chakwa should take well, a look. like the same... That will not be necessary. I just need yeah, some it's the rest. same Somewhere stuff quiet. as before. Like, the, all this was the same. We're done here. Dismissed. Commander, there's a comm buoy nearby. I can link us in if you want to report back to the Citadel Council. You know, to warn them about Sovereign. Do it. Set the link up, Joker. They need to know. Patching it through. Commander Shepard, I'm pleased to see your mission on Vermar was a success. It wasn't a total success. Sir, formidable enough without an army of Krogan serving under him. Uh, we got bigger the problems. The Krogan would have served Sovereign. A Reaper. Yes, we saw mention of this on your report. Sovereign, a sentient machine, a true artificial intelligence. Mm -hmm. This news is quite alarming, if it turns out to be accurate. You don't believe it? Sovereign's real. The Reapers are real. Saren even admitted it. He's playing you, Shepard. Saren still has contacts on the Citadel. He probably saw your earlier reports, the ones talking about your vision and the Reapers. Well, we spoke to it. It's highly possible Saren is using false information to throw you off balance. Our own intelligence has never turned up any corroborating information. Well, these people are dumb. Don't be stupid. I tried to warn you about Saren. You didn't believe me then, and look how that turned out. Mm -hmm. I believe you humans have a saying. Even a broken clock is right twice a day. You need Sooner proof. or later, you're going to have to take something I say on faith, Counselor. Try to see this from our perspective, Commander. Saren is a threat we can recognize. However, as far as we know, the Reapers only exist in your visions. That does make sense. Our decisions affect trillions of lives. We cannot act on the accusations of a single person, even a specter. Not without solid evidence. The Council cannot take any official action here. That is why we created the specters. You have the authority to act as you see fit. If My you truly believe Sovereign is the real threat, fit is you must people. take whatever steps They're are dumb. necessary to stop it. And Saren. Good luck, Commander. I'm always right, and they not. Us. We should get Ms. better Williams, people here. Commander, we need to talk. If we do not resolve this situation now, I am afraid things might become... awkward. Oh, awkward, huh? I hope we can keep this civilized. I do not want things to become unpleasant. Because With it's what? been so pleasant between us lately. Look, somebody in this room needs to make a choice. It ain't me, and it ain't you. Alright then, talk. Maybe we should try to work this out. I think we must. Mm -hmm. I mm -hmm. may not know much about human relationships, but I understand the concept of jealousy. Jealous? Of you? You're not even our species. That's kind of rude. Perhaps that is why you feel threatened. I am a rival unlike any you have faced before. Hostility is a common reaction to the unfamiliar. Doctor, you keep smart-assing me, I'll show you what my hostile reaction is like. Calm. Both of you, settle down. We can handle this like mature adults. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is stupid. Oh, You're not married, Shepard. You want to get involved with some alien? Go ahead. It's none of my business. It's not like that, though. You're special to me, Ash. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Kind of hard to feel special while you're always chatting with your little blue friend on the side. Or is that my role? This is exactly what I was trying to avoid. I never should have told you of my feelings, Shepard. I have put you in a terrible position. I am sorry. So, I chose this before. Big mistake. Big mistake. I had to redo the whole mission. So we're not doing that. Goodbye. I never meant for you to get hurt, but Ash is the one I really care about. I understand, Commander. Perhaps it is for the best. She is one of your own kind. Mm-hmm. I am sure you and Miss Williams will be very happy. I should go. I need to check on something. Sorry. Dear God, I think I actually feel sorry for her. Uh, I need some time. Liara is stronger than she looks. She'll be fine. Bro, I read that whole mission. I'm you never had mission. your heart broke at 15. Rejection hurts, Shepard, even if you act strong. 
Let's not talk about this here. It's not really the right setting for intimate conversation. You know where to find me. I do. Bro, that was so annoying. Redoing the entire mission. The whole hour. Redone. I had to make sure I chose all the same exact things. Basically, I chose that. What about both? And it ended up with uh, Liara. And I wasn't about that. And there was no way, I don't think, of undoing it. And the stupid save was forever ago. Alright, what's the, what's the vibe like over here? Vibe check. Hey, Skipper. Seems like everything's coming together. After what we saw in Vermeer, it better come together. Alenko, the lieutenant. I'd hate to think his loss meant nothing. Uh, we're not done yet. There's a lot of work left. There's always more. There's a reason for everything that happened, Shepard, even if you don't understand it at the time. Mm -hmm. Your assignment to Elysium, it put you in the right place at the right time. Your character made you rise to the occasion. And that got you here, commanding the finest tin can in the Alliance fleet. This is exactly where the galaxy needs you to be. No pressure. And what about you? Well, these are like the same. Where do you need me, Chief? Wouldn't mind a foot massage, sir. Sorry. I'll be serious. I... I need time to think. We've been focused on the mission. When we're done, it'll be different, I swear. You alright with that? Sure. I hear you, soldier. I'm in agreement. Glad to hear it, Skipper. Sleep tight, Shepard. Well, I don't have a bed, so I can't sleep. Alright, well, now that that two hours has been taken up because of stupidity, we'll uh, see what happens later. I expected something to happen there, but it didn't. Anyway, annoying, but whatever. For now, we...